enjoyment. Right, and welcome guys to episode uh, 7 of my single player Let's Play. Um, so in the last episode, we built the doghouse, which in my opinion doesn't look very good. So I'm going to have to work on art off, off camera. I'm going to be quite American then in my opinion. Um, but yeah, so... I think I found something good over here. Accidentally left it in shaders, but you know what? I think it looks pretty enough to stay. So don't worry. So in two episodes ago, we went north of our base, what it felt like north. So in this episode, we're going to go south um, across the water. So yeah, I hope everyone's having a good day today so far. I know I definitely have. Um, well, I might want to get that clay. Unfortunately, is there a reason why all my stuff looks pretty damn clean? It's because I died in the last episode. I was um, just AFKing my base for no reason. I just forgot to close the game. I had my inventory opened and then I was killed by a spider. And uh, Because if you were watching in the last bit of my uh, episode, I had no sound, which was extremely weird. I'm, I might still not have any sound. Oh, no, I've got sound. But yeah, um... What would be nice if we can either find the jungle or find the mesa. Um, if I find... Ooh, got another swamp there. So if we find anything good, I will remember to record. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so I don't think I've ever seen this before. Maybe I have, but I just can't remember. But it's in a savannah biome. And it's this huge lake in the middle of it. Like, I've seen lakes in Minecraft before. Wow, that looks so cool. I like this area. I really do. But yeah, as I was saying, so I've seen lakes in Minecraft before. Of course, everyone has. However, this is, I think this is considered deep ocean. Yeah, it's considered a deep ocean if you see. Um, I don't know where or not my, uh, my mouse is going to be picked up. But yeah, on that left-hand side, it says deep ocean. So that's pretty damn interesting. And how everything just loads as well. So this might be a potential base area in the future. Just a little heads up. But yeah, so that's quite cool. So that's not that's not even that far away from um, spawn either. So you want to say that spawn is um, zero zero, and that's only two thousand blocks in both directions. But yeah, what a nice area. You could really work on this. And it's like I really quite like the savanna biome. I just don't really like the wood. I mean, like the trees in the area. Um, for building with, but as like a background drop. Ooh, red sand. Oh! Well, isn't this lucky? I got really confused when I saw the red sand then, but look at that. Oh, let me take off the F3. There we go. Well, I needed um, stain clay and just regular clay, so that's good. That's good indeed. Um, so yeah, I will... I kind of don't want to destroy it though. Oh, I'm kind of stuck at a thing because I want to. I want to get the resources. Hang on. Wait, yeah, that one. Yay. Um, but I don't really want to destroy the mesa because it just doesn't seem such a pretty, such a pretty area with like really high up. Things and I could build a western. Oh my god! Like I can do different, um, different biomes, different builds for different biomes because this has got savanna. So I can do like a boat build in the middle. This could be like a western area. Oh my god! This is so perfect. I have to decide. Hopefully, I can find another mesa in the area. But yeah, that that looks amazing. Just this little bit as well. Okay, I'm going to be back if I find anything else, but that's so far, so good. It will be a real big shame if I had to um, get my resources from this area, because I don't really want to. So yeah, I'll be right back. Oh, I literally just stopped recording, just from on top of that uh, hill. And I think if you see in the corner, just over there, you can see the silhouette for another mesa biome. I think that is going to be my resource island. So that is pretty damn good, and I can't eat. There we go. So yeah, um, so what I'm going to do today is start my underground base. Um, I've decided on that. I'm going to get a diamond pickaxe. I'm going to try and get some more diamonds off camera once we get back to spawn, back to my home base. And then 
We're eventually going to do everything on the, in the nether as well, so we can link up everything. I'm not going to destroy that sand though. Oh, no, I am. I don't know why I did it on the island where I want to build, but not the island where I'm not. But yeah, so this is this is so far becoming a very... Oh, did, wait, did it not? Wait. Oh, did, that was really anticlimactic. Oh, well. Well, I'm going to get some sand, I'm going to get some hard clay, and I'm going to get some coloured clay, because um, what we're going to work on today includes... This should be yellow. For those who don't know, I'm actually colourblind, so... Uh, yeah, so yellow, orange, I've just, yep, so orange, and I want a red as well, so, um, if not, it's not hard to make red stained clay, because it is just, it's such an easy block to get, but yeah, I will start mining out of this area, but of course, I'm probably not going to be able to get very far, because I've only got this iron pick, oh, oh, what, okay, so, one, this iron isn't that big, which isn't really that m which really doesn't affect me that much. However, oh wait, what? Okay, hang on. Yeah, so there, one temple, and directly in front of me is another temple. Ooh, goddamn! I'm getting lucky today. Today is my lucky day. So yeah, um, I think we're gonna get most resources. Um, try and get some just designated colors. And I'm going to be back at base, unless I find anything else that's pretty good. But that's insane. I've never seen two so close to each other. I kind of want to collect the, um, the, um, mum, 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 the guardians from it. Because that'd be quite cool to have. But yeah, I will, I'm probably going to have to go mining here. Try and get some resources and then just set up a second base. Um, not a second base, but like a base where has all of the equipment that I need, like a chest and other areas like that. But yeah, I'll be back at base, hopefully. My actual base. The base with the dogs. Oh, that's another thing. Um, I started this journey with a dog. And now that dog has abandoned me. Oh, wow. I love it when even video game, like, NBCs just abandon me. Oh, God. <laughs> Hashtag relatable, am I right? Okay, yep. Yeah. So I'll be back at spawn. Uh, back at home. So I'm back. I'm back in my home. Um, and it was quite a successful trip. So it doesn't look like it's anything for my inventory. However, I look in here. I've got tons of iron. Like, too much. And then we got another so uh, too many diamonds to account. So I made myself a diamond pick. And I got a lot of resources. So what I was going to do, I will... Do it, um, wait, can I use redstone as a dye? I don't think I can, but should have some, yep, just some normal hard stained clay. But what I will do is quickly try and find a red flower. Do I see one over here, maybe? As this goddamn stupid spider tries to kill me. Um... But the colours I'm going to use for this um, floor in this new build, in the underground build, do you know what's weird? Is that these haven't grown yet, and I don't know whether or not it's because the torches are just too close. However, whilst I'm outside, I will actually light... Oh, we need to go exploring that. That probably just leaves the spider spawn that we found in a previous episode. But, um, yeah... This is, yeah, as we found out the other day, this is the dandelions. That's going to always be yellow, I think. I don't know enough about Faithful to say if that's true or false. Um, There's no red flowers on that field, is there? Um, I'm getting quite... Ah, I see some. Just over, I think that's them. So we'll try and venture over there, and then we'll go back into my house. I won't make it day, make it a challenge, you know. Um, so let's head over. Let's uh, play definitely not copyrighted stealth music in the background. Um, oh, I didn't know they were there. So yeah, I've been slowly... Um, okay, I don't like this. I really don't like this. Let's run all the way around. As soon as we get red flowers, I'm good. I just want to make. I just want to show what I'm gonna do. I kind of do want to make a day. 
What? I thought they only built near um players. Wait, is there no other ones? No. So yeah, thanks for the dimes that we found. All that, yeah, that we found in the um in the mesa. I'm slowly but surely getting all my levels back up. And now with all that iron that we found, I'm definitely gonna make a flame infinity. Okay, just get the flowers and run. Get the flowers and run. Flowers, 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 flowers. Flowers. Okay. Run, 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 no, 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 no. Okay. Run, 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 run. I can do it. I can do it. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. Too fast. Too quick. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I actually made it out. I'm surprised by that. But yeah. Now we have the. Yeah. It's just. Wait. Did another one blow up? I think another one blew up. I mean, I don't really mind it because I'm just gonna repair the area, but I'm probably gonna get shot to death. In a second. Oh my goodness, this is so scary. Uh, anyway, uh, now that we got the red flowers and got back safely, what I'm going to do... Ooh, that was an accident. I will sleep and then get the pattern on the floor, what I'm going to do for the floor underground. I don't think I showed it to you guys, or maybe I did. But it's just a little hole on the ground. It's going to be no lights. It's going to be um, single light at the very bottom. Um, and I think I'm going to take it there and then just stop it. But yeah, if you ever watched, um, it's from a few years ago now, Generic Bees, um, Minecraft single player let's play. It's it's the Minecraft series that got me into Minecraft. Um, so I'm basically going to make an homage to that and make my main base quite a lot like his. I'm not saying a lot because I'm doing it all by memory. I probably haven't watched this series in, a th in probably um, two years, three years. So it's very much going off memory. And I remember he had his... Um, he had two um, trap doors. One goes into like a hub area, like a very small like bedroom, and then like just a bed area, and it, it goes down and it goes keeps on going down. And then it was in the side. It was in water. It was also in the side of a cliff and something like that. And he had mycelium down there. He had pretty much everything. It looked amazing. Um, and when villagers were um, able to do trading, he did that as well. And I think. I think I remember what the floor is, but because he didn't have stained blocks back there, because he didn't have the mesa, because it was run so far, uh, so many years ago, um, he didn't have the chance to do what I'm going to do to this episode. So what I'm actually going to do in the meantime, when I will do this on camera, what I'll do with the rest of the iron. There it is. I'm going to make a bow, because I need it badly. Um... Do you know what also I don't like is the fact that these aren't gravity blocks. Um, sorry, these are gravity blocks, and I don't like that. So, two books, and sticks, and sticks, and stick. Oh, it's all perfect. Three and fourteen. My inventory is a goddamn mess. There we go. Bow. So, hopefully... Um, Do I put the bow back? I put the bow back, didn't I? Yes, I did. I meant to put the string back. Oh well. Um, I just really hope I don't. That is. That sounds very, very close. So let's go and hunt some zombies and some skeletons. Come, come fight me, bro. You're gonna be my first victim. Okay, so it doesn't do that much. There we go. Oh, you're on my roof. That's why you're so loud. Okay, this is a mistake. Oh well. But yeah, I'll off camera. I'll get the floor down. I'll make it day and stuff like that. But yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so this is going to be the general design of the um the floor in the main bit in the main area. But the only thing I need to work on now is trying to get all the other corners to match up. Because it's going to be a rectangle. So it's going to be quite hard to work on. So what I could do is... I'm basically doing this now because I was about to run off out of blocks. Is do need, only doing two diagonals. And then the filler block is going to be um, the brown the brown hardened clay. Yeah. Um, but... 
Um, oh, sorry, I landed in the middle. Um, so what I was, yeah, I fell down, so that's why there's two pillars here. Um, so because it's quite a weird design, and I need to basically get the pattern right, otherwise it does. You can notice it like over your eyes. So red's going over both. Right, red's going over orange, but under yellow. So this has to be a red block. And then that would go here, come over. Yellow goes under orange, however, over red. Um, I think. So basically, it's, it's almost like an algorithm. Um but for a design, and then that goes there, and then that goes there. So that's how it would end in a corner. So I could actually do that, um, and just have the one design, and maybe have some little mosaic sort of stuff-esque things in the other corner, because I do like the way how that looks, and I wanted to do this for a while, ever since I saw um, generic B do it back in 2012 or whenever he first because this is one of the first things he did in the series so uh, over orange but under yellow so that's how it would look that looks so nice damn and then with the brown how does that look the brown might ruin it actually Oh no, it doesn't. But that is, oh, now I'm out of blocks. But yeah, this is going to be the floor of my main on the of the underground base. So you drop in probably halfway in the middle. So that's going to be here. Um, this is then going to be floating over a bed of water. So that means I don't have the blocks on me, but I can make it. Um, so, uh, let's make a crafting bench. So, this is going to be oak as well. So, oh, let's make two crafting benches. Oh, well. Um, so, yeah, exactly. For example, one of the corners could be crafting benches, like a little three by three, and then furnaces with inside of it, or something like that. And the other side could be. It's basically. So, then one side is going to go down to the water. Because along the edge is going to be... I need all these because I'm going to do the build eventually. Um, so if I did something like this and then build up quickly. And put however around the edge, it's all going to be half slabs. Like this. And then the whole... And then I think is going to be under underneath that is going to have uh, water. No, underneath, underneath the slabs is going to have stairs, and then underneath the stairs on every single corner block is going to be a uh, fence, which is eventually going to pillar around and have enough support. But I don't know why I've done this because out on the open, because I'm going to have to destroy it all. And because where the base is over there and where the hole is, it should be quite simple to find the... Um, what am I trying to say? I'm trying to find the spider spawner, which we found in the uh, previous episode, and make that um, one of the first builds we do. But yeah, I don't know how I feel about the brown blocks, but I definitely do like the colours that we chose for the main design. Maybe white? Ooh, that'd be nice. But yeah, the orange, the red, and the yellow are definitely staying. I can 100% confirm that. Because, wait, how many... I don't have any... Because I might want to do this instead. So, Because right now it looks a little bit weird in the corners. Oh wait, no, that's not right. Oh, that's not even the right tool. Um, so red there and orange there. And of course a yellow... Oh no, a yellow would go here. So yeah, that would be quite nice. But yeah, if you guys did enjoy this episode, remember to like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next adventure.